Now let's create a Hello World application from the Visual Studio. For that, first of all, I need to install the Visual Studio. So I can simply search with Visual Studio download and that will give me an option to download and install the Visual Studio on my operating system. So there are different versions available with Visual Studio such as you have the community version, you have the professional, you have the enterprise version which you can download and install. Some of these versions are free of course such as the community version you can install on your machine if you would like to learn the Microsoft.NET on uh, for a learning purpose for example if you are a student or open source contributor or individual you want to learn .NET or C Sharp then you can use this free version of Visual Studio which is a community version it is free of course obviously it has got certain features which are not available as you have available in the enterprise level but those feature don't will not stop you learning c sharp as such so i would recommend that you should install the community version if you are learning c sharp for the very first time next you have the professional version which is best suitable for a small team or organization of with the small team members then you have an enterprise version which is basically recommended for creating the c sharp application at the enterprise scale it has got number of other features which are available like for example uh, to give your name for a couple of them like you if you want a live unit test code coverage or if you want to run a live test covering uh, test cases or sharing of the code between the team then those are some kind of a feature which will be available with enterprise version but as i said to getting started you can simply download on the community version once it is downloaded you can install these community version the versions are also available like visual studio code we have just now demonstrated about that and then you have a visual studio for mac as well which you can use to download on your mac device if you are using mac device to learn the c sharp I already have the Visual Studio code installed on my machine where I am using the enterprise version which is version 2022 so I'll simply search for that and I'll open that Visual Studio code 2022 edition which is of the enterprise edition right now.